Okay, I'm back for a third time today. Just went into the Dollar Tree. Oh, trying to fix this crazy phone. I hope it doesn't fall. I got a cool trinket in there that I think is gonna make filming in the car a lot easier if it works. I don't know, we'll see. But I have got five or six bags here and I wanna go ahead and start this and go over everything with you. Um, I had a blast in there, it was really crowded. I don't know if I got new items. I can't remember, but I do know. I, yeah, well, yeah, here's first things first. First of all, please subscribe to my channel if you haven't yet. I'm in a very busy parking lot, so I'm not going to scream, but I can't whisper either, or you guys won't hear me. Anyway, please subscribe to the channel. Um, give me a thumbs up and a comment if you uh, have anything to say. So, first things first, these are the things you stick in the ground, the solar lights. Um, whoa, I saw that a couple people had hauled the pink flamingo ones, and I was actually on the lookout for those. They apparently have not made it to my store yet, but I'm hoping when they do, I can grab two of them. So, I just feel like those and these... Uh, well, and plus I got the flower ones when they had those out. I just feel like those will be such a good summery vibe. Um, so I grabbed two of these. So that was the first thing I saw when I walked in the door and I said, yes, I will take those. Okay, I got Easter basket stuff. I got just a lot of different things. Um, I got this for my water. Um, strawberry peach Welch's. It is sugar free, right? Um, hold on a minute. Let me double check because I forgot to look. Let me double check the carbs. Oh, one carb. Okay. For half a stick. I don't like that. I'll probably give these to my, um, to my son or whatever. I don't know what's in here. I have to follow up on that. Um, anyway, yeah. I don't want carbs. I don't, if I'm gonna, I don't wanna drink carbs. If I'm gonna drink carbs, it's gonna be coffee. Okay, this is a horrible. Okay, let's try that. I don't know, that's better probably. Okay, yeah, I won't be drinking that, but it sounded good. I probably should check the grape one I got. Anyway, um, got this for Jackie's Easter basket. I might just give it to her, I don't know. It's called Yan Yans. Um, it's the, I never saw these. Fun animal name games on each stick. Cracker stick with dip. Chocolate cream dip. So I thought that would be a really cute Easter basket stuffer, but I might just give it to her just for the heck of it. Just because it is so cute. I don't know. We'll see. We shall see. I, I did find something for an Easter basket that I had not seen. I, I probably shouldn't, but... It's a mermaid. It is a marshmallow and gummy lollipop. I don't know why they call it a lollipop. It's basically marshmallow. It probably tastes like a peep. And then the mermaid is gummy. And I just thought that would be really cute in an Easter basket. I don't know. She'll probably take a bite of it and we'll secretly trash it or something. That sounds horrible, but no, never mind. We wouldn't do that. Um, anyway, isn't it cute? They had these and they also had llamas. She's a mermaid lover. I, I, I would have picked llama if I was going to eat it. But anyway, I was surprised to see a llama sucker. I think, I thought those was kind of geared toward women, basically, not kids. So anyway, that's cute. I thought she might enjoy that. I can't leave it out in the sun too long, that's for sure. Um, I found this decorative tape, and I basically got this for friend mail and for my planner. Um, it's the little heart... Can you see the little hearts? Yeah, thought that was cute. So, yeah, just for friend mail or whatever, you know. Um, I got this LA Colors Lip Duo with Gloss. It may be too dark for me, I don't know. It says Vibe is the name of it. I'm gonna open it up and check it out. Might as well check it out and see. Ooh, it's gorgeous. The gloss part probably wouldn't. It looks about the color of my nails here. I don't know if I like it or not. If I don't, it was only a buck. So, it's not going to kill me. 
Let's see. I probably shouldn't do this. Right here. Uh -huh. Ooh, it's a little dark. But I don't feel like it's bad. It smells good. Hold on. Mm. I don't, I don't, I like it actually. I like the color. Now let's see about the gloss part. You press put the gloss on top. The stick. Mm -hmm. Something about it smells really good. I don't know. I like it. Oh, it tastes good. Anyway, if you can see, it's a pretty color. I love it. All right, LA Colors. They are killing it this year. Okay, taking that. All right, I got me a little, I don't know. I, I can use this for, um, for keto. Um, it is the Biggs dill pickle sunflower seeds they're still in this shell here but i had never seen a, a bag like this so i thought i'd give them a try they do have um if you eat half of these it would be six carbs there's no way i'm ever going to eat half of these in one setting because i mean i don't like the fact of you know breaking them open and all that stuff but you know i might portion them out to about six portions yeah, that'd probably be more like it. So that'd be like a carb for a nice little snack. Um, so I think I thought I'd try, I think I thought. Yeah, I thought I'd try these. Dill pickle, come on, that's gotta be good, right? Okay, so let me put all this junk back and go into the next bag. I'm gonna have to have help carrying all this stuff in because I've been shopping all day, all day long. Okay, let's see what else we got. Okay. I got some stickers. So mine just pulled over there. Um, got some stickers. This is, oh, yeah, okay. This is reward stickers. I didn't see that, but maybe I can use this for Jack um, for if I get her to do something. I don't think so. I don't think she'd go for it, but it says um, 423 reward. Some of them, you know, are not, you know, they say wow and cool and yay and stuff like that so i think i could still use them but i think they're really pretty stickers yeah splendid okay yeah i can totally use these there might be some that i wouldn't want to but there's several sheets in here how many sheets is this it says the teaching tree five sheets and they're just like different ones there's sparkly ones there's just like this one says hooray yeah they're just really cute i thought i'd grab them okay and I got some of these these are the Mickey Mouse ones I've looked at these a couple of times and I thought nah I don't really need them but somebody hauled these these are not the ones that somebody hauled the other day all right maybe I should start looking at the stickers before I actually buy them these are all like Mickey well some of them are cute but some of them are like oh, see I would never use that I don't know I just don't know Maybe I'll save this for a giveaway, and hopefully the person that I give it away to can actually maybe have some little boys or whatever. Yeah. Okay, I got this. Um, I got it for somebody. I'm not going to say who because she watches my videos um, for Easter to go with their um, Easter bag that I'm getting them. She probably knows who it is when she's looking, but anyway, I thought that was pretty. White chocolate, pretty cross. It's from Palmer, a candy cross. So, thought I'd grab that. I just thought it was really pretty. Um, got this for Miss Jack to go in her Easter basket. Um, I said I was looking for the pencil case and markers and crayons. I finally have everything together. So, what I'll do is I'll put this in the Easter basket. She loves Miss Pinkie Pie. She loves all of these My Little Pony characters. All of these. Look at the back. Oh, she adores them. So, yeah. Anyway, this is going to be a long video if I don't hurry. Uh, this is the pencil pouch that I found her to put her crayons and markers in. Um, it's psychedelic. It says happy. And yeah, I love those. I've got two of those myself. I found a book called A, Keepy, a Kingdom Keeper's Adventure. It's probably geared toward young adults. But I just thought it looked interesting. It says finders keepers, losers sleepers. 
it's from a, be a best-selling author, Ridley Pearson, and I just thought it looked interesting to add to my collection, my ever-growing collection. Um, I, I got three of the cute hand sanitizers. I've been looking for these. I got the little llama one. This one is apple scented. Isn't that cute? I got the Bam. This one is um, Sweet Pea. I love Sweet Pea. And this one is Blow Pop. Blow Pop? Yeah. Um, it just says scented. I don't know. Charms. It's going to smell good. I have no doubt. And I found a couple of coffee cups I thought I'd get to add to my collection because my son has a tendency to break my cups when I ask him to wash dishes. So that just gives me a reason to buy new cups. I already have the green, olive green one like this. And we really like it. It's a pretty cup and it holds a lot. So I thought I would grab that. And then the other one, this is a good size cup too. I like good size cups. Um, this one says, coffee makes everything possible. So that's a nice one too. So, yeah. I love cups. I'm going to actually get rid of some of my older plain Jane cups just because. Who wants plain Jane cups? You know, there's so many cute cups out there that we need all the cute cups we can get. All the cups all the time. Okay. There's that bag. Now... I have. My husband has been wanting me to grab some of these for Jack when she spends the night for breakfast. It looks like the ones, you know, the Apple Jacks, the Frosted Flakes and all that, but it's the Dollar Tree ones. It's the Golden Foods brand, and I feel like they are going to be just as good. So I got two boxes of these. I won't go pulling them all out there. Um, I got two loaves of bread in there. I feel like this was an awesome deal on bread. It's nature's own. This one right here is sugar-free life bread, 100% whole wheat, 100% whole grain. I mean, a dollar? Yeah, that's a really good deal. And then the other one I have is also nature's own. It's um, double fiber wheat. So that's, oh, they smell so good. And they are so fresh. So yeah. That's an awesome deal. Bread and eggs. That's my new go-to right there for bread and eggs. Okay, let's see what we got here. This is my new toy. Auto cell phone holder. Okay, I can drive down the road. This actually clips in the vent. I'm excited to try this. I hope it holds my cell phone. But I am going to do, I'm going to try this. I hope it holds more. I hope it works in like sideways instead of just up and down because the picture that they show is up and down. I've actually got something similar to this but that goes on the dashboard in my Amazon cart right now. Have not ordered it yet. Um, maybe I won't have to order it. I don't know. We'll see. I don't know. We'll see. But um, yeah, for a dollar, I'm like, I'll try that out. Why not? Okay, I got some of this. It's the Deco Tape. Um, these are really pretty. Um, hold up, she could actually see them. Yeah, very pretty. So for friend mail, okay. I got. I found another one of these bad boys, and I got this for somebody special. You know who you are, but I won't say your name. It's for you. Anyway. Um, I got these to go in the Easter bags that I'm making for the family. Just a little something different. Um, I found these. The last Dollar Tree I went to, I found the dark, uh, or the black cherry with fruit. This is the peach in strawberry gel. So, this is going to go in Jacqueline's snack bin. She's going to love that. Um, I thought I'd grab a couple of more of these ceiling fan bulbs just because I don't want them to quit selling them. And me miss out because this is a really good deal for two bulbs. You know, bulbs are like, yeah, the economy is going crazy over bulbs. I mean, like the national debt can be cleared up just by selling light bulbs these days. So anyway, um, I grabbed this Pepsi lip balm. Mm -hmm. I know that's going to taste amazing. Here's the crayons I got to put in Jacqueline's little bag. I'll put the markers in. I'll put the whole bag in the Easter basket, and it's going to be adorable. I got one candle, only one, only one, unless it just really 
resonates with me. I will only be getting very few more because I got a ton of candles. Anyway, this one says Boho Soul, like Bohemian. And the colors on this candle are so pretty. And the scent, it says from the Rose Collection. Um, I don't know that it, that it says the scent, but to me... Oh, gosh, I don't know. It smells like a musky, musk, not musty, but musky. I don't know. Bohemian. It smells bohemian, baby. Look at that. Oh, that's a pretty jar. And that smells amazing. I love it. Anyway, <clears throat> let's get back to what we was doing. I'm so excited. I have had the most fun today running around everywhere and shopping and just having a blast. Okay, I still haven't gotten down with my morning coffee. It is now 2.56. Okay, a couple more bags here. Um, this one has these right here in it, but also I have a couple more little items in it. Um, these right here, they had on sale for a quarter. Caramellos. Do you guys remember Caramellos? I got six of them. I got these to put in the Easter basket um, goodie bags for my family. Caramellos, that used to be, when I was in high school, Caramello was the, it was, it was the bomb. I mean, mm, caramel. A quarter a piece? Yes. There's probably a best before date. Um, March of 2019. It's not like it's gonna drop dead, right? It's not gonna go bad right now. That'll be just fine in April. I guarantee it. Got these for my husband. It's the Utz brand cheese popcorn. Thought he might like this. He likes him some popcorn. And then, like I said, I got two of these right here. So, I have a feeling my husband might get in these. Just because he's been bugging me to get some. I don't know. We'll see. One more bag, guys. Okay, last one. I've got this right here just as a refrigerator organizer. Just, you know, you can pull it out with this little handle. Um, fridge storage bin. I don't know. I try to keep all my keto stuff kind of separate from everybody else's stuff. So, I just grabbed that. I need to clean it out for sure. Um, I grabbed this. I just like to have one of these just back in the pantry or the shelf. Just, you know, sometimes you run out and you're not prepared. So, I like to have that. I got this giant can of peach halves. Oh, geez. Okay. The whole car shook right there. Um, yeah. Giant can of peach halves. My husband likes this mixed with some um, condensed sweet can or no, no, no. Canned cream. What is it? Evaporated milk. Yes. And I thought him and my son could have this as a late night snack one night. Um, I got a, another hand towel for the bathroom. It's from Home Collection. It's an olive green color. Last thing I got it's not watermelon, so calm down, calm down. Sometimes I have to talk to our patients um, up close and personal, so I would like to rather have a minty type of gum. So yeah, got some of this to take to work just so I can be prepared for those situations. So you know, you know, it's life, it's life. Anyway, that is my haul. So I probably will not post this one until tomorrow just so I can have something to post tomorrow today is Thursday the 28th I think yeah this this month has flown by this year has flown by I cannot believe it's getting ready to be April wow time flies by okay guys well I'm gonna get off here and I'm gonna go home and lug all of this stuff in and put it up and I don't know what I'll do then uh, my husband will be home in about two and a half hours, so maybe I could just get some stuff done. Anyway, thank you guys for watching. And like I say, if you're not subscribed to my channel, please subscribe. Um, I am going to do that giveaway when I reach 500. So, I'm at, last time I looked, I think I was 176. So, working on that and I'm just excited to have this going on. I love it. It's fun. Um, so, if you like my channel, please subscribe, give me a thumbs up on this video, and leave me a comment. Thanks for watching, guys. Have a great rest of your day. Okay, guys. I have got my new phone thing here. So, if I ever want to...
want to do a video while I'm driving and talk to you guys at the same time like I see some other people do. It seems to be working okay. I'm just doing like a little quick trip around my neighborhood here just to see if it's going to hold up over bumps and I got Dollar Tree bags trying to go everywhere. Um, sort of a product review, I guess. This is the clip I got at the Dollar Tree. Um, it seems to, I mean, it holds my phone really good as far as the, you know, holding it. There's little rubber grippy things on there. Um, I felt it was a little bit crooked, but now it doesn't look too crooked. Not too bad. Um, yeah. So I'm just doing a little quick trip around my block, actually. So you can see me. Um, I think it has, it has, yeah. I mean, I think it's good. I may not even order one. Of course, if I wanted to, like, put it out there where I could show you where I'm driving or something like that, I couldn't really do that. So, I'll probably go ahead and order that one from Amazon. Um, I don't see me wanting to do that in the near future, though. I mean, I think this might be just fine right now. I just thought that would be a good thing to, to try out for a dollar. Uh, pulling into my street. I don't feel like it's shaking. I mean, no more than the car is. It looks sturdy in there. I don't know. I'll have to watch the video and see what it looks like. But, yeah. I mean, I'm, I'm going to give it a good review. A plus review. Or whatever. So, anyway. Bye.